Thank you very much, Ron. Everyone, I'm so excited to be here today to talk to you about how Microsoft 365 brings AI and teamwork together. At Microsoft, I run a team of developers. And a lot of writing code is really teamwork. My team of developers, we use Microsoft 365 for our collaboration. But today, I want to talk to you about how one of our leading customers uses Microsoft 365. What I'm going to show you is based off of a real world scenario. So in this scenario, imagine that I'm a first line worker in an airline company. In my company, I've been given this power app to help me with my job. This power app has been put together very quickly, connecting many different data sources within the company. I have access to my schedules. I have access to my contacts. But today, on my flight, I have a bit of a problem. My card here, my beverage card that I use to serve my passengers, is a tiny bit broken. So I need to figure out how to fix my card. So I go into my Power App, take a quick picture of it, and send the image back to my corporate cloud for a solution. See, normally, I'd have to call help desk, wait on the phone, wait some more, and then maybe I'll get my answer. But as you can see, with, my, with my Power Apps, I get my, my answer right away. And I can click on the link that it sends me to, and I have the SharePoint site with detailed instructions on how to fix my cart. So quick, so simple. So let me take my airline worker hat off for a bit. Now, that may seem a bit like magic. But as you can expect, there is no magic here. It's all technology. This happened because the IT admin in this company has put together a flow using Microsoft Flow that when I sent the image back to the cloud, the flow kicked in, intelligence and cognitive services was applied, the image was processed and identified as a defective cart, and that is how my solution was found. But the flow has also sent me a notification, and it does more than that. It tests if the frequency of the problem is greater than a certain threshold, and if yes, if it connects me to my other favorite apps like Microsoft Teams and Planner, but I want to show all of that to you in action. So on this side, imagine I'm an operations worker back at the headquarters. My operations team, we use this Teams channel to collaborate. This Teams channel has a lot of very rich conversations. I don't have to look at every single one of the message. The service alert here looks like it needs my attention. This was fired by the flow that I just showed you. When the flow realized that it was a repeated pattern, it automatically fired this alert. So my team can now pay attention. As you can see, my colleagues have already started jumping on it, but not just my colleagues. Ji Wu here, she's an external vendor from Korea. And you can see she has posted a message in the channel in Korean. See, I grew up in India and I speak three languages. Korean doesn't happen to be one of them, so I need some help in translating this message. With Microsoft Teams inline translation, I can hit translate, and just like that, I have the message translated in English. But sometimes, though, you can all attest, a face-to-face -face conversation with your colleagues really does help. So much can be said so quickly. So let me quickly jump on a call with one of my colleagues back on the ground. I want to see what's happening on the ground, but I also want to tell him about the service cart issue that we have found. <laughs> hey, Brad. Hey, what's going on, Raji? It's super busy here. I don't know what's going on, but let me just actually blur this so we can actually focus. That's so awesome, Brad. With blurring your background, you can focus on the most important things that you want to focus on. In this case, my dear colleague, Brad, here. <laughs> hey, Brad, uh, I wanted to tell you, there is some problem we have found with the service cards. Maybe they are happening at, at your location as well, so please keep an eye out, okay? All right, we'll watch for it. All right, I'll talk to you later, bye. Like a lot of you, I get invited to a lot of meetings. But I really don't have to attend all the meetings physically. With Microsoft Teams, meetings can be recorded, like this one right here, and played back at a later time. With Stream, intelligence gets applied, and speech is automatically transcribed to text, which means that then I can go ahead and turn on subtitles. This is super useful for people with disabilities and in high noise situations. I can also search for specific keywords. Let's see if anyone talked about carts in this meeting. 
Well, it turns out there are many conversations about cards. I can click on a specific one and jump into the exact point that I'm interested in. This saves me a lot of time. But now it's time for me to close the loop and inform a larger group of people, all the flight crews in the company, of this issue with the service card. For that, my tool of choice is Yammer. With Yammer, you can have rich company-wide conversations very easily. As you can see, with Microsoft 365, we put AI and teamwork together. This greatly increases productivity and simplifies collaboration. With that, back to you, Ron. Great, Raji. Awesome. I hope, you know, Brad is going to be here later, so hopefully he gets from the airport to here in time to do his demo. Um, I thought I'd now bring out a customer to talk about how they're shifting to a modern workplace. And to introduce Goodyear, I'd like to roll this.